It's a mixture of refined salt, water, and an electrolysis system without chemicals known as BEP. This solution disinfects any drinking water regardless of its source. The product is popular in Togo. Nous avons trouvé ce produit indispensable. We have found this product indispensable for purifying water, so by putting it on the market we want to contribute to increasing the degree of water potabilization in Togo and everywhere else in Africa, because we have found out that the most people are totally unaware of water purification. Yet when we drink non-drinking waters, we are exposed to waterborne diseases. It is therefore important and essential for everyone to disinfect the water before consumption. To treat 1,000 liters of drinking water, the innovator of BEP products recommends one quarter of a liter of the solution. After 30 minutes, the treated water is ready for use. The water must then be stored in a clean and closed tank. Bridget Sonia is trying to raise awareness of the product, especially among women. These women are all happy to know that there is now a solution allowing them to get drinking water. Today I can say that the goal is almost reached because we have more than 2,500 women who have already used BEP in their households and who are also satisfied with this product. Bridget says the solution does not have an odor or an aftertaste. It can also be used to wash fruits, raw vegetables and even disinfect wounds. I've been using borehole water in my household for years now. Before, my children always had diarrhea because the water from the well was not disinfected. But since I've started using the BEP product, my children are now healthy and nobody complains in this house anymore. I really encourage all women to use this product because I've experienced it and I'm very satisfied with it. The solution is packed in 250 ml and 500 ml flasks and it can last between six months to a year. It is selling for about five dollars. Bridget hopes to expand her market to other parts of the continent. Catherine Amwando, CGTN.